Hi everyone, today we are going to talk about Form 4, Chapter 3, Movement Substances Across Membranes. This whole chapter is talking about plasma membranes. So first, we need to know what is the function of plasma membrane. The function of plasma membrane is to regulate movement of substances into and out of cell. Phospholipids is an important component of plasma membranes. Each phospholipid consists of one hydrophilic case and two hydrophobic tail. So actually, what does hydrophilic mean? Hydro means water, while philic means a track. So what does hydrophobic mean? Hydro means water, while phobic means gap. This means that hydrophilic region attract to water, while hydrophobic region repel water. Okay, so now let's talk about plasma membrane structure. If in the exam they ask you to label phospholipid, you need to label like this. But if in the exam they ask you to label phospholipid bilayer, you need to label like this. This is because bilayer means two layer. Okay? Therefore, the phospholipid molecule will arrange to form bilayer in the plasma membrane. In the bilayer, the phospholip the hydrophilic heads will face us outwards to the extracellular fluid and the cytoplasm. This is because in the extracellular fluid and the cytoplasm consists of H2O. Therefore, the hydrophobic tail will face us inwards to each other to form a hydrophobic region. Hydrophobic region in the bilayer will act as a barrier to separate the extra subtler fluid from cytoplasm. This is because hydrophobic region does not consist of any water. Okay. The protein that has a pore in between is known as pore protein. While the protein that looks like a V shape is known as carrier protein. Pore protein is important in facilitated diffusion. While carrier protein is important in facilitated diffusion and active transport. Okay. The molecules that look like a S shape between hydrophilic H is known as cholesterol. Cholesterol is important to strengthen and stabilize the plasma membrane. The molecule, if the carbohydrate which is attached to the protein is known as glycoprotein. But if the carbohydrate is attached to the phospholipids, it is known as glycolipids. So from the plasma membrane structure, we can um, say that the plasma membrane is also known as fluid mosaic model. Okay, what does it mean? Mosaic is actually known as combination of many molecules because plasma membrane consists of different molecules such as phospholipids, protein, cholesterol, and carbohydrates. While fluid is known as while fluid means that the molecule in the plasma membrane is not stationary, means that it is not fixed at there but it can move freely. Okay.